This one happens strictly in the mind of the spectator. Maya, it's gonna happen in your brain, so be careful here. Something could happen. If you get disoriented, you could have a trickle of blood come down. Let me know. You could get all disturbed inside. Here we go. This is a mental experiment. Pack of cards. Okay. Now take the cards. Let's divide them about in half. Let's say oh, about there. Half for you, half for me. Put please, your hand on top of the cards. Do not let me get near them. Put your other hand on top. Okay? Perfect. Okay? I want you to like smash your head down on the... No, no, no. no. You leave them right there. Okay? Hold on to the cards. I'm going to ask you to think of one of the cards you see here. Okay? One of the top three or four or six or actually... Any of them. Any card you want, Maya. Think of it, grab it in mind, hold on to it. You got a card. Will you remember the card? You got it in mind. If I were to ask you to say the card out loud, and you were to say it out loud, and I were to go through the cards, take it out, hold my hands, and make it vanish, would you be impressed? Maybe. Oh, maybe, Mr. Sosalino. Maybe, maybe. Fair enough. How about if I have you name the card, and I didn't even touch the cards and made it vanish? That would be better, but I'm going to take this step further. I don't even want you to name the card. I don't want you to name it. Just think of a card. Keep the card in mind. One card, just a wiggle. Just a jump, like that. Do not say the card, even now. Just look to see if your card is still among these cards. I think, Maya, you are going to find, my friend, that that card is no longer there. Am I right? It's gone. It's gone. What was the card you had in mind? Ace of Clubs. Lift your hand. I want to show you something something pretty darn freaky because you'll see now in the dead center of the cards we held from the very beginning the one card you had in mind the whole 